blacks and disenfranchised and minorities have the same protections in America as the others. Mm. That's it. Skip no more, no less. That's all we want. We want equal protection of what we're supposed to have because we're law by we are citizens mm -hmm. just like everyone else so we're not going to be deterred and you see what's happening skip you see what's happening across america these athletes are starting to speak out these entertainers and more people are becoming involved in the process they're voting in record numbers because uh, they, they told us that now our vote matters and we're starting to see that our vote does matter because we see the other side fighting so hard to keep us from voting. Yep. So they tell us that our vote mattered, okay? So what have we done, Skip? We got uh, President-elect Biden, we gonna get him in office. It looks like we're gonna have control of the Senate. We have control of the House. Now, I don't wanna hear anymore, well, we wanted to, but Mr. McConnell blocked us. Mm -hmm. We wanted to, but this one happened. You have control of both houses. You have the president. Now it's time to see some laws get put in place that offer protections for minorities in this country. Mm. No more excuses. Mm. Skip, this is, I mean, why, why should we be surprised? I think sometimes, Skip, what happens is that we get a George Floyd situation. It's right there and, and for the, the viewing public to see. And he gets charged. You say, yeah, okay, we good now. But that's one in 100,000. What about the Tamir Rices? What about the ones that didn't? What about... Uh, um, Breonna Taylor. Mm -hmm. So it, it's, man, it's, it's just so fun. And I, I'm reading this and I'm like, why am I not surprised by this? Is it, black America, are we really surprised? We disappointed, but we're not surprised because we knew the outcome was going to be this. He was, it's always, he could have potentially had something where they're willing to ask and they'll reason and they'll, they'll be rational in their thought process if it's someone of their race that looks like them, that talks like them, they're so rational. Calm down, okay, let me talk. That's not how they do us. They, they, they shoot first, ask questions later, knowing with that qualified immunity. Mm. Now Skip, it's not, gonna, it's not gonna be easy because you know how those police unions, they're strong and they have a protection unless he leaves a manifesto that says, yes, I'm going out and I'm going to shoot this and this, it's nothing's going to happen. And at some point in time, when you spend hundreds and hundreds of millions of dollars in settlements, shouldn't that be a, shouldn't that say, you know what, we got we to change something here. We're spending out hundreds of millions of dollars every year in these settlements. But as LeBron and Wesley Matthews so eloquently laid out, mm -hmm. we're going to be undeterred at this. If you think we're going away, we're not. We're going to continue to turn out in droves. We're going to continue to vote. And we're going to continue to put people in place mm -hmm. that says we want better. We want better for America. But why should we be surprised, Skip? It's been going on for 402 years now. Mm -hmm. And here's the thing before I turn it over to you, Skip. Until America deals with this cancer, and the cancer is race. That's what it's always been. That's how America was founded. It's always been separate. You judge, you look at your skin, and you're black. That's why blacks were slaves, and the Native Americans, that's what. So it was always did that. So you can't go, I go to the doctor, Skip, and he tells me I have this debilitating disease and not uh, cancer. And he says, Mr. Sharp, we're not going to treat you. We're not going to talk about it. And maybe it goes away. Because that's how America has done with race for 400 years. We're not going to talk about it. It'll just go away. Mm. And it's been festering, and it's been festering, and, and it boiled over with the George Floyd. But change is going to come. Dr. King says it, it might not happen overnight. And it's gone on, it, 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 and it, it's gone on longer than what it should, Skip. But we're going to keep fighting, and we're going to get eventually, we're going to get, like he said, we're going to get to the mountaintop where we get treated fair. We get mm. fair representation. But... I'm so proud of what Georgia had done yesterday. I'm so disappointed in what was happening in Wisconsin yesterday. Mm -hmm. um, so uh, uh, while I was disappointed on one side, I was excited on the other. But Joe, uh, uh, President Biden, mm -hmm. you don't know this, bro. Now, you said you made all these promises. He did. If you do this, we're going to get these $2,000 stimulus checks. And we're going to get $15, uh, $15 an hour minimum wage. And we're going to protect that. Okay. Mm -hmm. The first 100 days, let's see some of that happen. Mm -hmm. And not that bull job that Tim Scott put before us that, that week. Uh, uh, legislation on police reform. We don't want any of that. Mitch mm -hmm. McCullough, I want to hear nothing you got to say. Lindsey Graham, I want to hear nothing you got to say. Mm -hmm. I want action. We want action. We demand action. Mm -hmm. By the way, Dr. King said change is going to come like in 1965. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, what about you watching, I think, within 63. Three. Okay. <laughs> Here we are. Here we are. Okay. So, I agree with your conclusion. 
Last night was a lot of mixed emotions. Yesterday was a lot of mixed emotions. Some very positive, some extremely negative. Yes. But I'm just going to gauge and judge the reactions of these star players mm -hmm. on both fronts, on the Jacob Blake front and then on the Kelly Leffler front mm -hmm. in your home state. Mm -hmm. Jacob Blake, reading LeBron's quotes, tweets, posts, Wesley Matthews, I sense the usual resignation, but it felt different this time. It didn't feel hopeless resignation. Mm -hmm. It felt a little more hopeful resignation, a little more resolve in the resignation, right. right? Right. Like, okay, here we go again. Is anybody surprised you? But nobody's surprised. No. But I still felt some new bits and pieces of progress and hope where the, the viewpoint has changed to, we still got this. Right. We, we've had a little bit and a little piece and a little bit and a little piece of progress here, and let's not give up the fight. Correct. And again, I always like what LeBron has to say about this, but Wesley Matthews, I, this one surprised me a little bit. I, I hadn't thought about him, but, but he is- He's from Wisconsin. His father played at the University of Wisconsin, mm -hmm. then was a point guard, obviously the backup, on two Laker championship teams mm -hmm. back in 87 and 88. Mm -hmm. And then even though Wesley Jr. was born in San Antonio, he went to high school up in Madison, Wisconsin, right. where University of Wisconsin Correct. was based, obviously. And he was Mr. Basketball in the state of Wisconsin in 2005, then chose to go to Marquette instead of University of Wisconsin, but he was a star at Marquette, and then you know the rest of the story. And last year, he winds up fatefully with the Bucks yep. in Milwaukee. Mm -hmm. So he was part and parcel of a decision that got made, what was that night, August 26th, right. in the bubble, mm -hmm. when the Bucks sort of broke ranks, as right. you recall, shocked to LeBron and to everybody. Shocked to everybody, because no one knew. Yeah, no one knew, and they decided minutes before a tip-off of a bubble playoff game, no, nope. we good. We're not going to go out there. We're not going to play. Right. And left the Orlando Magic just standing out in the arena by themselves right. like, really? Mm -hmm. No game? No game. So he was in the middle of that. And, and obviously that domino effect that night was, had it had national, it might have had international mm -hmm. impact. Yes. Okay. So he knows what of he speaks. And he calls himself, obviously, a Wisconsinite. And, and I, I liked what, what he had to say about this can't deter us. This is what you, what you just said. We can't lose our heads. We can't start rioting. We have to be calculated. Mm -hmm. And we have to continue to keep our foot on the pedal, to continue to push down 